there, it's Lauren Messiah, your personal fashion stylist, and it's time for a fashion question. We love these. Today's question is all about statement necklaces and how to wear them. I love statement necklaces. They're so awesome, and I believe every woman should have quite a few, I'd say at least three, at least three statement necklaces that just make you feel happy. Why? Because a statement necklace can upgrade a look and take it just off the charts. It can make people compliment your outfit, where without it, it would be like, whatever, boo, you're just wearing a t-shirt. So I am a huge supporter of the statement necklace. But how do you wear them? Sometimes it gets confusing because they're just so darn much. I'm gonna make it very simple for you, okay? First thing, a simple t-shirt. Just go simple. Like, look at this. I got a crazy statement necklace on right now. This is just a gray t-shirt. There's nothing crazy happening here. I could easily just wear this with jeans, with black leather pants. It's just a t-shirt and some darn pants or a skirt. But you put the necklace on and all of a sudden we've got an outfit. We've got something interesting. So don't overthink like what shirt you can wear with it. Just go into your drawer of basics and bust that out, okay? So that's, that's first things first, okay? Next is anything that has a crew neck or a higher neckline. I'm not talking about a turtleneck, okay? Now we're getting into some advanced stuff. We're sticking to the basics. But I really dislike a statement necklace with something like a V-neck or like a boat neck. I don't like my statement necklaces to be against too much skin, all right? Unless we were doing some sort of red carpet strapless thing, but we're talking about everyday clothes. So avoid V-necks, anything with a lot of exposed skin, and go something where it just, it just meets the garment, it just meets it where it's at. Look at me covering the neckline of this crew neck t-shirt. I also like to avoid things with collars. Now, there's opposing views out there. I watched a video the other day with a stylist talking about statement necklaces, and she loves pairing them with things with collars, kind of sticks it underneath the collar. To me, it's a little too preppy, it's a little too contrived, and it can be confusing for someone who's just starting out trying to wear a statement necklace. So, anything confusing, I say skip it. Crew neck, hello, t-shirt, hello, super simple, okay? And third, you want to make it the focal point of your outfit, okay? It's the statement necklace. We're making a statement. So please don't muddle it up with a pair of earrings, with some crazy headband. Like, let that accessory shine. Let's not put crazy rings and an arm full of bracelets. Let's let this be the thing that grabs all of the attention, okay? And lastly, don't be afraid to wear your statement necklace more than once. Like, you can make it your signature thing. I just bought, let's see, here it is. I bought this bad boy the other day. Woo! Let me tell you, I put this in my shopping cart, and then when I checked out, it was sold out. And then two weeks later, it reemerged. So this is my, this is my boo. And I wear this with everything. I can dress it up with a little black dress. I can wear it with a t-shirt. I don't care if I wear this thing two days in a row. It's kind of my thing. So don't be afraid to get a lot of use out of your statement necklace. It's okay. It can be your signature piece. And because you can wear it in so many different ways, it's totally cool. All right? So those are my tips for how to style a statement necklace. I hope those tips were helpful. If you have a question for me that you want me to answer on video, or just a topic that you just want me to talk about, ask it in the comment section below, and I will do my best to answer it right here on video. Speaking of videos, you've gotta subscribe. You, you can't be foolish and just come back and then not subscribe because you might miss a video because these things are happening very frequently and they're very informative. So please subscribe. And if you want more lessons on how to dress, I have free resources below. Ebooks, checklists, guides, all these great items, they're free. So go get those, subscribe to my channel, and I'll catch you in the next video.